Hey guys, it's Kristen. I'm a rural squirrel. Welcome to Vlogtober. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be such an eventful, like jam-packed month. There's so much happening. So make sure that you are subscribed if you aren't already, but if you aren't, why not? <laughs> Hit the like button, um, tell your friends, make a comment, do all those good things, because there's a lot and I mean a lot happening in October. I'm not even sure that I'm gonna have time to get all of the videos out that I wanna share with you, but we're gonna do a video every single day because there's so much going on. I also have friends that are gonna be doing Vlogtober with me, Angie Resells and the Nashville Flippers. So Ray's got a video coming out every day, Angie's got a video coming out every day. And of course our friend Paul Philly Flipper also already does a video every single day. So not just Vlogtober for me, but check them out too. As we get started with Vlogtober, I wanna make sure that I tell you everything that's happening, but to get started, I'm gonna share with you a video of a brand new bins that just opened it up in Denver. This bins opened up and I was there for the very first day. So stay tuned, that's what's coming next, but be ready for a jam-packed month of some amazing stuff that I can't wait to tell you about. Junk stock is happening. Boss Reseller Remix is happening. I have a cruise at the end of October and we've got some things that are gonna be happening personally that are gonna change the game for me completely. So make sure you subscribe. Here's the footage from the very first ever bins trip at the new Denver bins location. It was such a fun day, so here you go. Good morning, hello, my name is Kristen. I'm a real squirrel. If you are a full-time reseller, you know that the only reason that you get up early <laughs> is for a good yard sale, a good estate sale, or the grand opening of a thrift store, not just any thrift store, a Goodwill outlet. There are now four Goodwill outlets in the Denver area, and today <laughs> we are we at the grand opening of the fourth one. So this is really exciting. So my phone is fully charged. I have my hair in a, in a ponytail so that it stays out of my face. I have comfortable clothes on. I have comfortable shoes on. I have a snack. I have a full water bottle. I am ready for success. <laughs> and I can't wait to show you this new grand opening of this Goodwill outlet, this bins. I did get, a get here a little bit early because I wanted to see what it looked like whenever it opened. And I didn't know what the cart situation was. I don't know what the parking situation is. I, I was gonna be traveling in the middle of rush hour traffic in Denver. So I did leave a little bit early. So I'm here, there's already a line and we're gonna go check this thing out. So. I'm gonna give you the lay of the land, I'm gonna tell you what I find, and I can't wait to get to a new Ben's location in my hometown. It's better than I thought, but the outlet is over on the side of an offices. So it's like the Goodwill outlet headquarters, office room, offices, office building, and it's around the corner. Okay, there's tons of people. <laughs> I've been hanging out with my friends. They had a tailgate, they, so a bunch of friends brought donuts and <laughs> they hung out. This is a party. They're ready for this to be open. So we're going to go in and I'm going to show you what everything looks like. But parking was okay. Um, but everybody's excited. No one is allowed to shop until management gives you permission. We have shopping carts along the side of the mall. And anybody who is the that it's unsorted. What do you think? I feel like it's already been through the bins and this is just, yeah. So I found quite a few. 
quite a few flannels, so I'm doing good in that respect, but I, <laughs> I think that there are a lot of people that are like, oh, I thought it was going to be so much better. You know what? Bins are bins. They're different every time that you go somewhere else. So just because today is not a great day doesn't mean that tomorrow isn't going to be awesome. So I'm not worried about it. I'm finding stuff, but I can find stuff anywhere. But I'm having fun. So I'm going to keep digging, and if you would do me a favor, go ahead and hit that like, hit that subscribe, tell your friends, make a comment, do all those good things. Um, and if you're not subscribed yet, why not? That's the one I go to. I like you that were, one. You were having fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's coming full circle now, isn't it? <laughs> Look at you. Oh, yeah. Gucci shoes. Okay, so in the beginning, there was plenty of carts. Lots of carts. Um, I grabbed a cart. You saw me. I put it up against the wall. Somebody's already put their stuff in my cart. So I put stuff in the cart next to it, and they threw the stuff on the floor. So the carts are already woo, a little bit of an issue. So somebody's already stolen my cart or taken my cart and using using it. So luckily I brought a bag. Always bring a bag with you. Um, <laughs> but already, somebody's already uh, taken my cart. That's disappointing because there's plenty of carts. Well, there was plenty of carts. Thought I had a Patagonia. No. So I think it looks really good. It's clean. Everybody here is super chill, super friendly. That's what's nice about the bins in Denver. Everybody uh, wants to help each other. Everybody wants to try to get along. Everybody wants everybody su su to succeed. And I'm about that. So I had a cart. Somebody dumped out all my stuff. And I don't have a cart anymore. So now I've taken to found another cart. And um, carts are not a commodity. But somebody liked my spot better? I don't know. I thought he was going to tell me to quit recording, but he wanted to pick up something that was on the floor, so... Rotating actually really fast. 
there's a lot of people here, but um, there's a lot of stuff. It's really clean. Of course, it's the first day, but um, they're rotating really fast. Like, good. And I have found like a few things, like a dozen maybe flannels and a couple of light fixtures. That's about it. <laughs> See you next time. New bins. So that was fun. <laughs> it's always fun to go to a new bins. I will show you what I got, okay? So this was Ware's. I'm gonna use this basket for display. And then this is really cool. This is like a Bakelite. You put it on the, uh, it's vintage, so you put it on a bed. Um, you put it over the, your bed at night. So it's a night light, like a reading light, but it's Bakelite. Isn't that cool? It doesn't have a date on it, but I would say that this is probably 30s, 40s, 50s, somewhere in there. I'll do some research on it and let you know. So check my Instagram stories to find out more about that. Linens, these are anthropology. I don't know if these are gonna make it into my store. My daughter might want them. <laughs> this shearling coat cost me $8. It's so big, it's so heavy, but it is so nice. I'm excited for this one because sometimes these things can be hundreds of dollars. So we'll find out. This one's not vintage, but it kind of has that Yellowstone look to it. And I may use that even in my keywords. Flannels. More flannels. Hey, look. Flannels. A Harley shirt. More flannels. That's awesome. Thank you so You're much. welcome. Have a good day. You too. Thanks. And a quilt, you guys. You know how I love quilts. Now this one's a newer one. Um, it is handmade, it's uh, machine quilted, but it's still really cool and it's still gonna do really well. That's it for me. I had a great time at this new bins location. Always love checking out good new bins. Always love hanging out with friends. I always love showing you what I find. So I hope you guys are out there finding amazing things too. I hope you guys are out there doing amazing things. I will see you guys next time. I'll see you in the bins.